lumi vjosa. Kur është ko e mira i bet hari ku ua. Edhe mali malet rethero dolqian i jap në bukur i të rati fshati. Shiko, vëntlidja është e shtrejnë. Ne këtu jemi rritu, edhe ëndrat i shikojmë natën, i shikojmë këtu në, në shtatë. Ku do që jemi? Kam përnuar këtu në lumë, me gjithë fëmi. Kam rritu pesë fëmi, edhe, edhe ata kam përnuar bashkë me mua, këtu. Në mban, dhe na ushqen me gjithë. Si bëdhe mos natyrë që është një natyrë e pastër e vigri. Gjithë të tokë që ne në mbanë, ajo e mbytë. Shu që ne dhe dalim jashtë loj, edhe si kom, jo si personë. The Viosa River is one of the last large, wild, free-flowing rivers in Europe. Wild rivers are really kind of a, a rare thing on the landscape right now. They are kind of free-flowing rivers that are not affected by dams or other human impacts. Um, they really are really a glimpse of what all rivers of the world used to be like in the, in the past. Rivers in many ways are, are arteries of the landscape. So much like arteries of the human body, they're really important to be kind of flowing, bringing blood to and for different organs. So rivers do the exact same thing. They transport energy and nutrients from different parts of the landscape. When I see dam construction, it's, it's severing those arteries. Over the last kind of couple of decades, there's been increased recognition that, in fact, many of these dams are no longer serving their purpose. They're either aging and requiring a lot of money to repair, or it's just quite striking that the ecological impacts can be quite high. In addition to affecting fisheries or affecting uh, livelihoods on rivers, they are also a source of greenhouse gas emissions. So the fact that they're uh, sustainable or completely green energy is actually not true. The Viosa has been not studied uh, in a thorough way, I would say. So it's only the last four or five years that uh, scientists are, uh, are having studies or research. Viosa does has its, its uh, plans for hydropower as well. We are in time to avoid the worst. Them që ai të bëhet, pra shuja sepse ambienti do ndryshoj, infrastruktura më ndryshoj, ja do regulohet ujtë pishëm, do regulohet energia elektrike, dhe këto themi se do tjenë, do tjenë risuset mira për komunitetin. Unë e kam vreshit të bëjnë aki, të bëjnë verë, të, të bëjnë gliko, recet, me, me atë tokën që kam ati. You have three rapids. Uh in a row and then it's calm and easy again and then suddenly you, you hear 
the water again and you think oh there's another one <laughs> and uh, so you're always a little bit in tension but it's uh, really amazing they plan or they already started actually to build dams but i love it the way it is uh, uh, because uh, since we, we 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 know that it's maybe one of the last rivers in in europe which is not under construction or is used for uh, uh, water, uh, electricity. Here, here's the dam, and we are just around here. Well, I'm pretty glad actually that I can do it in 2019. Uh, I can actually uh, raft the river. Maybe in 20 years you look back and uh, it looks completely different really sad that uh, other people probably couldn't can't do it anymore <laughs> Shtetit dëgjoj komunitetin, mos të bejë si mba sa të firma e të duan të fitojnë para, edhe të varrosin gjithë të popullë të. Protesta pajqësore? Jo me bojnë le tovë. Ne nuk bëftë mirë se më kejtë s'ka gudve. You have seen what happened with the Notre Dame de Paris. So everyone was able to everyone everyone was able to to donate and to restore it and why was that? Because it's something unique. And when we are talking about European natural heritage, it is our costume. It is uh, Aya Sofia. I don't know uh, Notre Dame de Paris. It's not ours. It's not uh, theirs. It's Europe's last free flowing river. <laughs>